It's a chilly day here in Central Florida. I'm Ed and today I'm cycling the Little Econ Greenway Trail. The west end of this trail is located approximately five miles northeast of downtown Orlando. The west end of this trail is located at Forsyth Road north of US 50 and the east end is at Alafaya Trail across from the University of Central Florida. I'm starting here at the west end Unfortunately, there's no trailheads nearby, but there's several along the route. The locations of the trailheads are marked with stars on this map. My understanding is that there are plans to extend this trail about one and a quarter miles directly west to connect to the Kadeway Trail. The first mile of this trail runs along Partridge Lane and goes across and along Goldenrod Road for a short distance before getting to Arcadia Acres Park. It's another great day for a bike ride. This canal carries water from Lake Baldwin to the Little Econ River. Arcadia Acres Park is a small neighborhood park that has parking, restroom facilities, a playground, and basketball court, a soccer field. This part of the trail gives you the option of going straight to the east here for two tenths of a mile to get back to the main part of the trail, or to go to the right for seven tenths of a mile to get to the same point. The trail goes across this bridge and over a tributary of the Little Econ River. If I had continued through the, the soccer park back there, I could have uh, taken a little bit of a shortcut here, but this trail is short enough. I'm going to take the long way around which is this route that dips down towards 50 and then back up to the, uh, the place you would have ended up before on the shortcut. From what I understand, there are five dams along the Little Econ River uh, adjacent to this trail today. Let's see if I can find them. This first dam is the Cheney Dam. The Cheney Dam, like the other dams on the Little Econ River, were built for flood control. This one was completed in 1970. This trailhead has plenty of parking and is accessible from US 50, known locally as Colonial Drive. This is just east of Goldenrod Road, not far west of State Road 417. This trail map will help orient you if you're new to the trail.
This is where the two tenths of a mile long shortcut from Arcadia Acres Park rejoins the trail. Going down this bridge a short way, you can see looking back on the trail with the soccer complex on the right and the trail straight ahead. Going back out to the trail and turning left, in a very short distance I get to Econ Park and Soccer Complex. Econ Park has the usual amenities such as parking, restrooms, playground, picnic shelter. It's right on the trail. At 2.2 miles from today's starting point is Harrell Road. There is a small parking lot right there at Harrell Road, right next to the trail. This little parking area up here is next to Harrell Road. Immediately after crossing over Harrell Road, there's a left branch of the trail that goes over the Banner Dam. Banner Dam was completed in 1968. This next section of trail between mile 2.2 and mile 3.7 crosses under State Road 417, goes up through a power line easement and crosses under the Econ Trail and gets to the uh, Horseshoe Bridge. From Horseshoe Bridge, we'll cross under Dean Road and go along Blanchard Park and end up at Michael's Dam.
This area is a butterfly garden located right along the trail between the trail and Union Park Middle School. Directly across the trail is this picnic shelter. It's been an interesting ride so far. An interesting little trail with uh, a nicely paved surface and several parks and bridges and dams along the way. Econ, as used, is a shortened version of Econ Lokhachi, which is a Native American word from the Muskegee language, literally meaning earth mound stream, or river many mounds. Today's trail runs parallel for a length of it along the Little Econ Lokhachi River, which itself is a tributary of the Econ Lokhachi River, which is uh, a tributary of the St. John's River. As such, it flows to the north. The trail skirts around the outside of the Blanchard Park YMCA property. Michael's Dam is easily visible from the trail. It was completed in 1965 to, again, to control flooding of the Econ River. You can go up on top uh, of the bridge there and ride your bicycle across. It's a very popular spot for fishing. The eastern 1.7 miles of this trail goes from Michael's Dam, exits Blanchard Park, goes across Rouse Road, and over some wetland areas and ends at Alafaya Trail. I had mentioned earlier about the five dams along the Little Econ River. Turns out that only three are visible from the Little Econ Greenway Trail, the Cheney Dam, Banner Dam, and Michaels Dam. There's a nice shaded bench and water fountain here, right where the trail meets the Lokonotosa Trail. This bike trail parallels the Lokonotosa Trail up to the Alafaya Trail. I'm at the east end of the trail right now, and this is as far as it goes for the moment. I understand there are plans to expand it further to the east into the UCF campus. Get out and enjoy the trails. It's a great day for a bike ride.